Hello everyone and welcome to part two of episode two of The Walking Dead season two. <laughs> Man, that is definitely a mouthful. And it's probably going to be like that whenever we get to part three of episode three. But anyway, okay. So last time we got stuck in a ambulance van with Pete. Uh, Pete unfortunately didn't make it. We made it back to the house. Uh, Luke and... Uh, uh, Luke and uh, Alvin went out looking for us, and uh, so uh, some others left to go find them, and now we are hanging out with Sarah, looking at uh, whatever the hell she found. So uh, let's, uh, let's, see, uh, let's see what she found under the house. So, yeah. What do you got, Sarah? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? Nobody tells me anything. It's too dangerous. Uh, everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back! That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? No. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. Hello? Okay, how are you? Well, I'm doing just fine, thank you. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? I'm Carly. Carly, that's a sweet name. You mind if I come in, Carly? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Just me and, and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Or is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people, seven of them to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and hmm. an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. I haven't seen them. Well, that's a shame. You sure? Pretty sure. plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through or you've been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. 
Hell, I just got here and I already don't want to leave. Been here for a year. Is that right? It's dangerous to stay put that long. Surprise you've lasted. I've been lucky. I doubt that. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. I forgot how, like, creepy this guy is. Well, this is a real nice place. Kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. I miss him. What's his name? Carlos. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. <sighs> what was that? Jesus. I thought you said nobody's here. It's probably just the wind. Yeah. Now claim this is where you go and grab the knife. <laughs> Or just find some object to uh, bludgeon him with. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Who's this? Must be someone who lived here. Must be. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? Give him the silent treatment. <laughs> well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Don't come back. You have a real good day now. Oh, man. Woo. <laughs> it's, it broke a sweat there. <laughs> Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. Well, they told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? I didn't ask his name. You didn't ask his name? How could you not ask his name? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? How old was he? His voice was gravelly. Like how? I don't know. Kind of deep and scratchy. 
He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Uh, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. Now, right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. Oh, so shit. I didn't mean to, <laughs> I didn't mean to we hit that one. I panicked. He was oh, scouting. Man. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Oh, boy. Now, you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. I still don't like what you did. Sneaking around on us and taking advantage of my husband. But I know you were in a tough spot. I'll try to cut you some slack. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us. It's a long story. He... He has a hard time letting go. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. Ugh. I'm, used to that. <laughs> I'm not comfortable with it. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know yeah, what to call it. Yeah, not be a or him at that main fucking bitch. God help me. <laughs> Any ideas? Clem? Okay. Oh, it wasn't any wheels, man. There. Hmm. That's where we were. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. <laughs> Uncle Pete. Oh, uh, Nick, do you really have to yell? Pete. There he is. Uh. Oh my god. W what happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Who did this? Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's gone. Nick, he, he, he's gone. We gotta get moving. Come on, man. Come on, Nick, before the walkers come back. <laughs> it's 
Tell me. Tell me how it happened. He saved my life. Well, that was... that was Pete. I'm sorry. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. We may not be perfect, but we look out for each other. I have to look for Krista. She was headed north, right? Yeah. So are we. Look, you're gonna have a better chance of finding her with us than on your own. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Ben. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. <laughs> it's just Nick. <laughs> He's just dumb and behind. Hold on. Five days later, we're going to find out what happened next part. <laughs> Man, I went over time. <laughs> I got so caught up in uh, the game that I lost track of uh, I lost track of the video. But, um, yeah. Okay. Anyway, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, all that fun stuff. Be sure to follow me on all my social media, which you can find in my channel description. So Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Twitch, Discord, all that is there. Plus my other two channels, which I highly recommend you check out. Especially my review channel, since that is my main channel. And uh, the podcast channel, you might get some really good laughs out of it. So, anyway, have a great night. Thank you all so much for watching. And of course, don't forget to take care of yourselves. See ya.